My name is Natalie Ryan. I teach at North High School in Bakersfield, and uh, this is my eighth year in the classroom, and I teach high school agriculture. You know, when they ask you in kindergarten, you know, what you want to be, I always said I wanted to be a teacher. One year I asked Santa for a chalkboard for Christmas, and uh, I think back then I didn't understand what it meant. As I got older and that idea was still in my head, I, um, I started seeing teachers that I really looked up to, and I wanted to be like them and have that same opportunity in the classroom. I think most importantly, I saw a genuine like, love and compassion for their students and the best teachers. It was so much more than their content area. You know, they cared about who I was as a person. And because of that, I really wanted to work harder for them because I, I felt like it mattered. When I tell people that I'm a teacher, the first response is usually, I'm sorry, you know? And it's so disappointing that that's the perception um, that we have of teachers because I go to work every single day and I feel fulfilled and I feel like I have purpose. Um, I tell my students that I want them to find something that they want to do so much that they would do it no matter what. Um, and that's how I feel about being in the classroom. Uh, there isn't a job that I've ever had that I go to work and it doesn't feel like work and my day just goes by in a flash. Um, you know, in agriculture, we get the chance to teach so many different types of classes. And so my day is never boring, and I also never know what my day is going to include. And that's fun. My biggest advice is that um, the school culture that you're in, the community that you're a part of, um, to take it all in and know that it takes a while to get your feet under you, you know, to figure out the classroom and your school community and how to balance life. And once you figure that out, it's worth it. Um, my other piece of advice is, <laughs> you know, my first year teaching, I had a little ornament that somebody gave me in my classroom of a fish. And I still have it hanging up in my classroom today. And in the beginning, I needed to just keep swimming, you know, figure it out one step at a time. It gets easier, and, and once it gets easier, so much fun.